Hey everybody, it is Dak here from the Ed Boys, and today we're briefly talking about the Scar Essence Mine. Jagex has given us a new method for buying runes from shops, but actually taking shops out of the equation. In this mine, you're going to be able to obtain extracts, which can be used to make runes at any altar, and it's going to make a ton of runes at one time for you. To unlock the Scar Essence Mine, you will need to complete a small portion of Desert Treasure 2 so that you can unlock the Scar, which is located in the Guardians of the Rift area. When you're in the Scar, go over this Stepping Stone, which does not seem to have any agility requirement. In the cave, you have to first talk to Haggis, who's going to explain to you the general process of how to do this. Make sure you go through all of Haggis' dialogue options, or he's going to keep interrupting you when you try to mine. So there's a lot of spots around the mine that you can mine tainted essence chunks. This does require 66 mining, and then you can turn these chunks in at the ventriculus opening, which there's also multiple of them around the room. Once you've collected a bunch of essence, you can collect the runic extracts from the ventriculus. Uh, these extracts you can take to regular rune crafting, and when you make runes with pure essence and you have these extracts on you, it's going to give you a ton of bonus runes. To collect these extracts from the ventriculus is going to cost you some coins, though. You can put coins in the coffer that's located in the center of the room. That's really the whole process. You mine Tainted Essence, put it in the Ventriculus, put some coins in the coffer so that you can get your extracts back out from the Ventriculus, and then just have those extracts on you while you do regular rune crafting to get those bonus runes. There's four different types of extracts, each of them costing different amounts and able to make different runes. Let's go ahead and check out this table real quick. You have Warped, Twisted, Mangled, and Scarred Essence. The main purpose of this content was to remove the need to hop worlds and buy runes from shops, or at least give us a different option other than Shopscape. This is really only helpful for runes that don't currently have rune packs in the shop, like Blood Runes or Astral Runes and stuff like that. It's actually a pretty expensive way to buy runes through the Scar Essence mine instead of using the shops, which is reasonable to be fair. They wanted this content not to affect the rune market, so if main accounts were to make these runes and then they were going to sell them on the Grand Exchange, it costs way more money to make runes like this than you would actually profit from, so generally only Iron Man really should be doing this. This is only helpful for Iron Man accounts. Honestly, it's still a bit pricey for stacking up a lot of runes. 400 coins per blood rune is pretty thick. Also, you still have to have the rune crafting level to make these runes, because you actually have to go out to the altar and do the actual rune crafting. It's not like you just turn in the extra for free runes. So in a way, there's still a little bit of benefit from buying runes from the shop. This new content hasn't taken Shopscape away, it just gives us another option. Overall, I feel like Jagex did hit the goals that they wanted with this content. Iron Men have a different way to stack up a lot of runes by actually using in-game mechanics instead of just hopping worlds a bunch and buying them from shops, and it shouldn't negatively affect the rune market, which is good because runes are already at a very low price. This is a solid update for the Iron Men that need it, but overall it's not a huge deal, uh, and there's even some excuses for Iron Men to not use it, especially if you don't have enough coins lying around. If you still have any questions about how to use the Scar Essence Mine, be sure to let me know in the comments section below, and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Let me know what you think about this Scar Essence Mine update. If you like it or if you don't like it, let me know in that comment section below. I like the idea of actual gameplay being used instead of Shopscape, so the update does get a thumbs up from me, even though I won't be using it a lot in the near future. If you enjoyed the video or you just got some useful information out of it, be sure to like and subscribe for more content. I also stream on Twitch, which should be linked on the screen and in the description. Thank you for watching, everybody, and best of luck on your runecrafting grinds.